Hi, I'm Laura Fugazzola from the University of Milan and we will talk about on how to select the first line treatment for patients with advanced thyroid cancer. Well, we have two available type of compounds, the anti-angiogenetic drugs and the targeted drugs. Uh, they are extremely, uh, have a, a very high efficacy uh, for all patients, but they are uh, quite different as far as toxicities concerns. Indeed, anti-angiogenetic drugs have a, a high frequency of important uh, toxicities uh, which sometimes are difficult to manage, whereas the targeted drugs, uh, which are directed uh, uh, only against the mutation responsible for the development of a given tumor, they have very uh, few adverse events and especially uh, high-grade toxicity uh, do not exist for, uh, with the, these targeted drugs. So when we have to select with the drug uh, with which to start the treatment, the systemic treatment in a patient, we have to think about, first of all, the availability of those drugs in our country, because not in all European countries uh, these drugs are reimbursed. And second, we need to preserve the quality of life of patients. We really don't have much experience related to the shift from a tyrosine kinase inhibitor, inhibitor anti-angiogenetic drugs to a targeted treatment or vice versa. So if possible, if it is possible, we uh, um, prefer to start with uh, targeted drugs due to the um, presence of a very low frequency of uh, adverse events.